and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Vicki and in today's video we're going to be checking in for the second week of May's sinking funds. So we went ahead and did um, four transactions in our sinking funds for the week. They are in haircuts at slash beauty and then one kid's miscellaneous. So let's go ahead and put down stickers and talk through that. All right, um, with this, I'm trying to think what day we had. I think it was the 9th. Camila and I had a haircut appointment. And then Jim actually went and got his haircut. I think it was Thursday. And I went and had a pedicure on Saturday. It was so nice to just get away for a little bit. Um, and let's see if I could put this on where it doesn't well, you can't see the date, but we'll know. And then also Kids Miscellaneous. I'm going to put it on Friday, but actually I took the kids to Target. They actually haven't sadly been in a store in, you know, since COVID. Um, we just haven't taken them. Anyway, I took them. They got to pick a toy at Target and that was really fun to see them light up. So those are the sinking funds. Let's go ahead and check in and write down. Now, if you're new, the reason I do this is that I want to be able to refer back and see like what, what we spent money on. Cause I used to just do this where you just see like what came in and what came out. But sometimes I want to know exactly like, what did I spend our money on? Or, um, I know we spent money in haircuts, but who's hair, who was the last one to have a haircut? So this has been helpful for us. Okay, so this one was for Vicki and Camila. She actually didn't charge me for Camila, but I did want to, again, put down what we did so that I could refer back to it. This is for Jim's haircut. And that does include tip. So did that one too. I don't know if these are good prices or not. Um, Jim went to just a local barbershop and I went to, with my girlfriend that I've known forever. Uh, the 14th we did, oh, I did the um, pedicure. And that did not include tip. I tipped her in cash. I feel like... Um, in the Bay Area, this is really expensive. And when I lived in Los Angeles, it, pedicures were so cheap. But when I moved up here, they were really expensive. Um, okay, and then this was the Kids Miscellaneous um, Toys at Target. You know what I didn't do? I did not um, true up the envelopes or check to see if we have exact change. So we'll be doing this together. All right. So it's just haircuts and so let's do this together. Where is my calculator? And here is my draft sinking funds tracker and what I would do is take this and say okay 60 plus 34 plus 46 140 and let's just put this all being the 14th take away 140 and this is in frame 728 take away 140 is 588 in our sinking funds. So we got a $500 placeholder. So I need 140 to put aside 20, 30, 40. So 140. And that should leave us with 588. So 550, 60, 70, 85, 86, 87, 88. All right, put that back. I'm excited I had 
exact change. And then kids miscellaneous. That's not in here, right? Nope. Kids miscellaneous is twenty two thirteen, so we will take. Take away 23, 511 remaining. Okay, so let's take out 23. Do we have three? Yes. Okay. And do we have a 20? Yes. So 23. So this would leave us with $511. One, two, three, four. 4, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 95, 500, and 5, 10, 11. Looks like we need a condensing here soon. Okay. Okay, so let's go ahead and count how much money we spent this week. One hundred, twenty, forty, fifty, sixty, two, sixty three. One sixty three. Yep. Week of May. And let me know if you have any questions. I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Consider subscribing, giving this video a thumbs up, clicking that notification bell to let you know when we um, upload another video. And in the meantime, go ahead and leave me a comment down below and let me know which sinking button you use this week. Take care. Bye.